Good morning and welcome. Um, today we are here again in Crested Butte, Colorado. And this morning I am doing the Brush Creek Trail. And it's like a nine minute drive from Crested Butte, so not a far drive. And I am starting off with the 70 to 200 millimeter lens on my camera. And yeah, just gonna try to see what kind of wildflowers and views that I can get. I do have a couple different lens options with me. I have my 24 to 70 and my 50 millimeter prime, but I'm gonna see if I can't maybe stick with just the 7200 for the most part this morning. There's some birds flying around, so maybe I'll be able to capture some birds. But anyways, my main goal is just to wildflowers and views and just whatever else interests me this morning. So it is, sun has just came over the peak and it's 6.51 a.m. So yeah, it's a nice, nice, beautiful morning. It's a little cloudless right now. So I'd like there to have been a little bit more clouds, but uh, beggars can't be choosy. So anyways, without further delay, let's get the hike going. So Crested Butte is called the wildflower capital of Colorado. And um, this past weekend, before I arrived here, um, was part of the Wildflower Festival. And so apparently it's like a 10 days of like everything imaginable related to wildflowers that happens here in Crested Butte. They have like photography workshops and all this other stuff. So I miss that, but um, still plenty of wildflowers to be had. Um, so I'm really just excited. Uh, with the sun coming in, we got some rain last night. And with the sun coming in, it's making for some really, really soft photos. And so um, I'm really excited, I think, about editing these photos because it's going to have a kind of, I think, a little bit more of an airy, warm feel is what my feeling is how these are going to be edited at this moment. Um, there's some, I think these are, I don't know, they're, is it a sneezeweed or an aspen sunflower? I'm not entirely sure which one these are. They might be sneezeweed, but I'm gonna take a picture of these because these look really pretty with the yellow. And uh, yeah, we'll just kind of continue on. But yeah, just really, I mean, there's just all behind me, all that yellow that's up on there is just wildflowers and stuff. And so it's just really pretty to just how they're blanketing the side of the mountains and stuff. So ah, gonna, it's gonna be a, I'm not gonna make it very far, very fast, that's for sure. Cause I'll be taking pictures everywhere. made it very far at all. I ended up getting a, meeting a fellow photographer and we chatted for probably a good 30 minutes and stuff, um, which also means I probably lost some of the best lighting to be had this morning, but this is just an absolutely beautiful trail. There's so many flowers, it's unbelievable. Like there's the trail that's back this way is just lined with, I think they're the sneezewood flower. But it's just absolutely, it's just the whole hillside is just blanketed with flowers. It's, it's incredible. I would highly, highly recommend coming to Crested Butte if you really want to get some landscape photos or flower photos, landscape photos with flowers or flower photos, because it's incredible that just how many wildflowers are just blanketing the hillside. It's, it's so cool. I love it. Um, I wish the lighting was a little better, but you know, that's okay, um, but oh, just absolutely beautiful. And then you got your aspens that are kind of like right there on the ridge line and stuff. And so I think I got some good wider angle shots. I did swap to my 24 to 70 millimeter lens, um, mainly because there was just some of these, this vista over here that was more in line to my 24 to 70 capturing those than the 70 to 200 but um that's why you have lens that's why i have lens options so i can change my mind and swap lenses so um i have no idea how long i'm gonna how far i'm gonna hike for um it is now 8:26 a.m so um might not uh 
might not make it terribly far on the trail, but ah, oh, it's just so beautiful. Ah, oh, that's okay. Doesn't matter how long I'm out here. The fact is that I'm out here, enjoying nature, taking photos, doing what I love. So anyways, ah, oh, so beautiful. I'm just gonna continue on the trail, take photos of what I think, see if things of interest and uh, yeah. Ah, what a gorgeous morning. Right, so we are heading back to my car so that way I can uh, check out of my hotel room on time. Um, I didn't make it that far on the trail, but the trail is absolutely beautiful. There's great views. Um, if you are looking, if you're in Crested Butte and you're looking for a place to do some sunrise photos, this would be the place that I would do it because the sun rises over right behind me. It's rising <laughs> or it's risen. I'm sorry. Um, but the sun rises over these mountains and I just can only imagine how, if I was to have gotten here earlier, how beautiful this area would be with the flowers and um, just the hills and all the greenness and stuff. So if you're looking for a sunrise spot in Crested Butte, I would probably check out this place because it's uh, the Brush Creek Trail because it's absolutely gorgeous. So I think I got some good flower photos. It's just incredible to see all the flowers um on the hillside just almost like a blanket of yellow and stuff and it's just absolutely beautiful um yeah i yeah, it's a gorgeous morning i wish there was a few more clouds in the sky but that's okay it's just it's what mother nature gives you and when you're on vacation beggars can't be beggars can't be choosy or picky or whatever that saying is so but anyways um I'll go ahead and wrap up this week's video. If you liked the photos that I took in this video, please consider giving it a thumbs up and sharing it with your friends and family. If you have not yet subscribed to my channel, I really hope that you do so you can continue to come along on my photography adventures here in Colorado with me. Um, yeah, it's been an absolutely gorgeous morning and I'm so glad you were with, with me on this journey. So you guys have a fantastic rest of your day. We'll see you guys next time. Take care, bye.